Hello everyone, hope you're right. Today I have come to the garden center to look at some plants for winter interest or like evergreen plants. So I thought you may want to go with me and look at what is available in the garden center in winter. So there is not as much color as you would expect in spring or summer, but it is still very colorful, very bright, very cherry and so beautiful to look at all these plants you can see these beautiful hanging baskets with schemia um, cyclamens primroses they are so so beautiful so there is lots of evergreen interest and there is still some color like winter flowering plants cyclamens schemia and uh, ivy vines and some conifer and you can see they have got a whole lot of these christmas trees they are selling them these days and there are loads of sheds and garden ornaments and garden furniture still available so there is lots going on in the garden center so this time of year many people are not thinking about the garden they think gardening season is over and they wait for next spring but this time is the best time to go in the garden center to look at the plants which plants look good all year so there is lots of plants with all year interest year-round interest or winter interest which will still look good throughout the winter so you can see these evergreen plants there is lots of foliage color and texture so i'm really mesmerized by their beauty how good they are looking so you can imagine them in your garden if you plant them in your garden your garden will be bright and cheerful all winter long so you might know that we moved into our house this january and it was bare lawn with few trees and shrubs so i did a major transformation and i'm still uh, you know developing the garden and i recently shared my november garden tour the garden was looking good and this year i mostly planted annuals but I do need to bring more winter interest or evergreen interest in my garden, especially in front yard. So here I have come today to look at some evergreen plants or like autumn or winter flowering plants. So there is lots to choose from. And the good thing is many plants are on sale or very reasonable prices. So these hellebores are looking good, cucras and cyclamens, you know, these evergreens, grasses and cordylines they were on sale so basically it's really a good time to visit the garden center there are not many people around so you can take your time looking at the plants appreciating their beauty to imagine how they will look in your garden and you can choose what you want for yourself so there's a lot of hellebores and schemias which are in bloom there are some dianthus as well some chili plants which are on sale so this whole section is like on clearance so half price so i chose some from here and i was looking for some specific plants which were not on sale but very reasonable prices so i got some of them so this fuchsia plant this was like seven pound during the season but now it's half price so i will get one of this for my front yard it's evergreen it blooms beautifully so it will look really good i don't fancy grasses uh, in my garden so i'm not gonna buy any grasses these are some climbing vines i have already got a few climbing vines in my garden i may buy one or two trees i'm looking for magnolia tree but i couldn't find one these berry bushes they are really beautiful as a hedge make a beautiful hedge conifers on sale as well so i do have some you know evergreen plants and some year-round interest plants already in my garden they are very well established if you haven't checked any of my videos you are new to my channel please go and check my garden tours there are already so much going on in my garden but i do want to you know make it look better all the time so there are lots of you know sedums and ground covers available schemias are looking so beautiful but i already have two schemia bushes in my garden so it's really tempting to look at these plants and to buy them but if i already have them in my garden so i need to carefully look what's not in my garden and what i would like to have there
these bushes were looking really attractive these are pyrus with flowers on them and their variegated leaves were absolutely beautiful but i already have a pyrus bush in my garden but it not bloomed this year so maybe it's not in the right place but it looks really beautiful with its blazing color leaves and changing color it changes its color during the year and these were really beautiful as well and this is butterfly bush and i was really attractive to it but i have got a butterfly bush in my garden and i don't really like it so i do want to replace it with something else uh, these mm, red foliage plants were really beautiful so although it was bright but it is really cold and windy and you know wind keeps knocking down the plants and uh, although they have year round interest or winter interest but still it's a hard time to you know take care of them during the winter so that's why they lower their prices in winter because they want to get rid of the stock or they want to reduce new stock so it's really good time to make some bargains these big topiary plants are really expensive i always want to buy some of these but i can't really afford them and you can see there is a huge lot of uh, containers so many beautiful designs terracotta and the modern ones and it's a joy to walk in the garden itself even if you don't want to buy anything i think it's still worth to take some time out and visit the garden center just to walk around what's there and look at the plants it's just you know a treat in yourself primrose is here herb section lots of herbs smell really beautiful so while i was looking at the plants i realized i hadn't brought my bag no wallet no credit card so i would have to go back and get my bag and credit card so i thought i look inside as well you can see there are lots of barbecues available and lots of garden stuff and furniture on clearance so it's really a good time not just to buy the plants but to stock up on other things related to the garden and outdoors and you can see there are lots of seed packages as well bulb section where you can buy spring flowering bulbs i like to grow from seeds and i have grown many plants from seeds but it's really limited what you can grow from seeds with regards to variety i think if you buy the plants which are already grown in the garden center there are more choices and they are more resilient or more versatile in how they perform garden tools and indoor garden section plants so if you don't have any outdoor gardens you can still grow plants indoors in your house in your apartment in your balcony there are so many to choose from and they look so beautiful and they take really less care and they also present the plants in a very good arrangement so it gives you ideas how can you uh, put plants in your garden or in your house so they will look even more beautiful some christmas treats so i'm going home now to fetch my credit card and my bag so i can come back to buy plants which i have selected so these plants i have got in my cart you can see uh, there are lots of evergreens so i got some sedums and can't remember the names of everything but there is cordyline there is helibores there is this um, red foliage plant couldn't remember the name of it there is this variegated leaf plant so i'll show you in the detail what are these and they are really good bargains in summer they would be more expensive so let's go and pay for them my cart is really full so i have paid for them and now i'm going to put them in my car and then i show you the receipt how much they costed me and what there is
so this is bnq this is diy home and garden store and their prices are very reasonable and there's lots available all the time so here i have got all these plants and i'm trying to fit them in my car boat so here is my receipt total bill was 55 pound exactly it was 65 pounds so 10 pound was like you know reduction and there is euphobia there is sedum there is japanese azalea there is hebe helibores hardifusia and lofo myrus cinerea and cordyline so lots of plants so i'm really happy with my purchase today and it costed me much less than i expected so i would really recommend that you visit the garden center this time of year to get some treats for yourself so i hope you enjoyed watching today's video see you in next one bye bye